So you know the good way to get the plant out of here. I know the good way. I grew up in the suburbs of Washington, D.C., and I had lots of opportunities to go on hikes and, you know, participate in the environment. And then moving to Philadelphia, where people are so disconnected from the environment, really made me want to find ways to bring a little bit of nature back into the city. This garden actually started 15 years ago, and where we're standing used to be a street. Um, and then the city closed it off, so it was a fenced-off concrete patch and Urban Tree Connection came in and worked with bot captains to turn it into a garden. And they've been working in this neighborhood of Haddington for about 10 years. When I was a freshman, my friend was writing a business plan for Urban Tree Connection for a farm that we have right around the corner. And they needed somebody to start farming that year. Now I work on several gardens throughout the neighborhood. It's a really awesome job. When you see a kid just eating collard greens for fun and it's like a tasty snack for them, that just keeps me going. We grow all different kinds of vegetables. Um, these are mustard greens. They're spicy. Kids love eating them as a snack. Um, <laughs> and uh, these all wintered over. We have other collard greens out here right now. Then today we're planting lettuce, peas, radishes, leeks. I think giving people an opportunity to take some control over their neighborhood. That's what I really try to do with the kids. Getting the Truman and the Udall have been really amazing. Getting the scholarships to me is like a, a good sign for what we can do with, with the Urban Gardens and is really gonna help me pursue graduate studies um, in social work and business to make this into a bigger thing. I kind of envision a, a larger system that somebody who has just a little garden in their backyard can sell a little bit of produce into it or you know a larger garden like this or community gardens. There are a lot of projects like this going on in the city and while they interact some I think there's a lot of potential for it to get to a bigger scale provide more jobs, more educational programs, and just make a larger impact. Just having some idea about where your food is grown is so important, and that's the biggest thing that somebody can get from participating in a garden like this.